heading for a showdown. Two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big occasion. Now they get their wish. Fans the world over are fully focused on this atmospheric stadium where the drama is about to be played out over the next 90 intriguing minutes. Who will prevail? You're watching EA TV. Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Norway up against Portugal. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And in with a real chance. Oh, no. Couldn't beat the goalkeeper. Corner given. This is how it looks for the home side. Well, it's regarded as a negative shape. But if they control the middle of the park, play some expansive football, the wide players can then come in field to join the centre forward and the fullbacks can push on. Let's hope they do that today. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Ruben Neves plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Good piece of closing down. Determined defending. Oh, big chance! And he thwarted the attack with a masterful tackle. Bruno Fernandes has it. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, the referee opting for the lenient approach this time. I think it's a great bit of referee, and everybody now knows the next foul will be punished. And Norway have it back now. Very alertly winning back possession. And he has options available. But timely defending when it mattered. Holland. Good looking sequence. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defense. Good movement. Being egged on by the crowd. Oh, fine stop. So the corner played into the box. Could still be dangerous. Can they jump in front? There it is! The first goal of the game, and the lead certainly doesn't flatter them. Good value for it.
So back underway, having conceded, let's find out if Portugal can flick a switch and come up with a goal of their own. Bruno Fernandes has it. It's a promising move from Portugal. But they took care of the situation defensively. Being pressed hard. It is a decent looking attack here. And a fine tackle. Neves. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. And he might be through here. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. And the emphasis is on creativity. But they dealt with the threat first. An well, advantage coming into play, and rightly so. Good work from Norway to win back possession. Pressure applied. Clean challenge. And defensive play to be applauded. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, Norway couldn't retain the ball. And he's in. And missing the chance. Well, he strikes it cleanly, no doubt about that. But unfortunately, he's missed the target. He's got to score there. Not great from the keeper. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. But I think he knew that was coming. Yellow card it is. Well, that was always going to happen. He needs to control himself now, otherwise it could get worse. Danilo Pereira decides to shoot and that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger so Portugal behind but now what can they do with this corner delivering it clearance needed to be better tremendous block goalkeeper getting in the way superb save Can he deliver it with accuracy? And it's in! All square again! What a match this is turning out to be! Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal.
That is that for the first half here. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Very quick thinking there. Martin Odegaard. And Portugal regaining possession. Ronaldo. Trying his luck. Chance maybe. Threat over for now, it seems. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point. Because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, disappointing end to the move. It is a decent looking attack here. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. In with a chance. Must be goalkeeping of the highest order well he's got to be pleased with that save it's absolutely magnificent well they've been frustrated for quite a while now but these fans have suddenly come to life short corner favoured well that's how to keep the opposition at bay He could really get at the opposition. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. Well, as you can see, this has been a fairly open contest. Chances at both ends, plenty of good attack in play, and it's been really entertaining. Pulls it back. Oh, and nearly on target. Not quite, though. Yeah, very nearly, but the goalkeeper had it covered. It wasn't really a great effort. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. I'm really closing him down here. Good use of He's in with a chance. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. Well, underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. And play halted, free kick given. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Perfect tackle. And Norway regaining possession.
Now this could be productive. Oh, he's through here. And a goal! Real excitement here. The equaliser. Well, as you can see here, Fernandez gets beyond the challenge of the defender, and Fernandez does the rest. He hits through the back of the ball with such power. What a great finish that is. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Holland. Oh, big chance. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And he's in. Nicely timed tackle. And Portugal regaining possession. And he has options available. Just ten minutes to go. Really good challenge. Well, still pushing forward, it's a matter of whether or not they can come up with an equaliser. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Aursnes. On to Holland. Determined defending. Wasteful here from Norway. He's in behind. Well, no luck in terms of finding the target. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. And teammates around him. How can they find a late leveller? This could level it. Well, the post getting in the way there. Well, able to survive that attacking push. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today.